to hurry up and drop some music on you. Now I'm dropping music on you, and you want to come with the uh, with the heart. But did that you know the, the did you know song. the meaning behind dropping? Give me fifty. Yeah. Yeah, man. It's, it's, it's yeah. shit, man. This our this my art. We me wait, and bro was talking. What, what? My bad. What was? What do you think is the meaning of it? From the the dropper, give me fifty. Uh, what was it like? Top Kendrick's drop. uh deal. He was giving uh what t- uh, top dog like fifty percent of everything. Now he giving Taylor fifty percent of everything. Taylor who? Swift. Where the fuck that come from? Ain't he? I believe he signed the Taylor Swift's label. What? Yeah. That's I how think, much uh, I ain't in tune to Kendrick, but I ain't know that. Taylor's Taylor's uh, Taylor's producer <laughs> did do uh Euphoria. If I'm not mistaken. Taylor's did. producer produced so, uh Euphoria. So do that not make everything that Drake was saying before he you gotta wait for Taylor Swift to drop, Taylor Swift dinner on you. And then Taylor Swift now, drops. That's and irrelevant then, now, you see baby. How, that just fucked me how up? was that, that irrelevant? I'm gonna tell you why that's how was that irrelevant. I'm gonna tell you, I'm, hold on. How I'm, was that irrelevant? Ask the question again, and I'm gonna tell you. How was that irrelevant? That that he talking about he gotta wait for Taylor Swift and all that. Why? Because he just knocked Taylor Swift off the charts on Apple Music. But when? But that's Taylor, the point. Taylor dropped and took them off the number one spot. No, that's look up beside Apple Music the, right now. No, not right now. Not Cap right it. now, baby. So whatever he talking about, he got to wait on Taylor and all that type of stuff. He that's did wait relevant. on Taylor. So it ain't irrelevant because he, he had to do he, that. He, he, couldn't. he gave Taylor Whether, a clean week. Man, he gave Taylor <laughs> three weeks. Well, he was waiting on K-Dot for three weeks. And then Taylor dropped. And then all of a sudden, here come K-Dot with all these fucking records. Nah, I'll check the timeline again. Can we fact check that? Check that timeline, baby. Do y'all think that this beef is going to last through the summer? It's over. Nah. I don't think it's going to last through the summer, but I think we got like another month. Of this I don't shit. think it's over. It's over. I'm going to tell you why it's over. Because it's a special man. Hold on. Y'all know I like to come with my little research. It's a special man by the name of Lucien Grange. Do y'all know who that man is? No. Yeah, I do. I ain't here. That is UMG. That is the Universal Music CEO. Yeah, and been you been know he owns um, everything is under UMG. <laughs> yes. All the Sony and the Interscopes. He trying all to make that yeah. shit is up under UMG at the end of the day. Crazy. Drake right now is his golden boy. He finna make oh, I did read up on that. That's cuz name. Okay. Yeah. Lucius. That's what that four hundred four hundred million dollar deal. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. yeah okay. So listen, let me run this shit down for you real quick. Um, Go ahead. Kendrick Lamar's Euphoria opens as one of the biggest moments in hip hop history. Number one on Apple Music in multiple countries. Biggest streaming day ever for a disc record. Biggest streaming day of the year for a rap song, Spotify. Biggest streaming day ever for a rap song over six minutes long. Second biggest day ever for a Kendrick Lamar song. Eighth biggest streaming day ever for a solo rap song. Most viewed rap song in a single day on YouTube in 2024. Potential top 10 debut billboard with only three days tracking. Most viewed rap song ever in a single day on Genius. 